Welcome back to www.ubo.net. Today we're going to be talking about the M100 just a little bit more. In the previous uh, video, we taught you how to install a hard drive. So now that you have a hard drive installed, you're going to want to put all your favorite content on it. So in this tutorial, we'll explain how to do that. Now with every single M100, we provide you with a cable. Let me show you what that looks like a little bit. And that is right here. And you can see the cable, it's a USB 3 cable. Uh, this is the USB 3 port device that goes into the M100 and this other USB port will go right into your laptop or PC, whichever one you may choose. Now, because it's a USB 3, that means that it will go faster than a regular USB 2 port. Now, once you got the one side connected into your player M100, up right here, sorry about that. Let me just get that in nice and snug, there you go. And then the other side you will connect into your laptop or PC. So let me go ahead and do that. Once connected, you'll see on the M100 that there's a little blue light here. That means that the M100 has been connected. And because it acts like an external hard drive, it doesn't need a power source so that you could transfer files back and forth into the unit. So once you have done that, you're just going to wait for your computer to recognize, as you can see, it's up and good to go. And you will be able to open your Windows Explorer and view the files inside your M100. Now, let me maximize this for you guys. And uh, basically, this is, where, this is your hard drive folder right here. From here, you can load everything you want, your favorite movies, pictures, and music. Whatever it may be, you can load onto the hard drive and you'll be able to enjoy all your content on your TV. And that's basically how you put all your content on the M100.